Well, after five years of planning and fundraising, the fate of Bemidji's Carnegie Library was in the hands of the City Council tonight. A Josh Peterson was on hand as the Council considered continuing the project. Bemidji's Carnegie Library, a historic landmark in the heart of downtown Bemidji. At one point, the structure almost faced the wrecking ball. But after a six to one vote, the project to save and restore the city's original library will be put out for bids, meaning the Carnegie just cleared a major hurdle. For the committee of Carnegie supporters, the council's vote leaves a good feeling. It really came down to tonight because uh, t tonight was the go or the no go. Um, the fact that the council supported us so strongly and were so complimentary about the work that we've done and our commitment to this is really encouraging. Prior to the vote, Bemidji Mayor Rita Albright said that the council owes the committee and the project their full support. I think it would be an ultimate slap in the face for us not to do this project just to, uh, to, to go forward with it, to intend to finish the project. While the Friends of the Carnegie have raised over $1.5 million for the move, restoration and preservation of the structure, some council members have no doubt that the city will not be left with a bill if the city moves forward with construction. I know that it is the full intent of that committee to consider these dollars that the city would be spending as a loan. They don't intend to stop fundraising. And it is their goal to replace any dollars that the city would need to expand here because they have a shortfall. There's a lot of different avenues that I think open up if we do go to bed. There's a chance that we could see that uptick in fundraising that people know that this is happening. Once the project goes out for bids, it will be up to the city to accept a winning bid and Library Park could soon see significant construction later this spring. In Bemidji, Josh Peterson, Lakeland News. In the six to one vote, council member Roger Helquist was the lone no vote. The Carnegie project is expected to go out for bids in early 2018. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.